<clears throat> hey everyone, we're back with more Conquest of Elysium. I'm Dirty Dungeon, and we're playing the Dryad Queen. Can't exactly remember what we're doing. I see we got a lot of elite units down here. I seem to remember something about that army. And, uh, oh, it looks like they're about to take our port over here. That's not too, too good. And then we have this as well. Where's our main? Our main druid is here, Nara. But I believe she has a weaker army than the southern army we have down there. I don't think we have a lot of charming spells. I don't know what we're doing up here. Are we going to plant a hamadryad? Are we going to... Create a sacred grove, perhaps? That could be smart. Let's, uh, let's create the sacred grove. We'll do Bramble Fort probably soonish. <clears throat> could be smart. Could be. Hmm. And what else are we to do? I thought, did we recruit a keeper of traditions already? That I saw there? Maybe we did. I'm not too sure. Looks like somehow we still have this little grove here as well. Hmm. Yes, looks like we do have a keeper of traditions over here, so we're planning on spawning some minotaurs, perhaps. We have these grove guards as well. Very interesting. Man, they have a shit ton of hit points. Rather good. This keeper of traditions has a good amount of armor. We have a ring of the dead recruit some warriors or something else 125 here only five satyrs here huh gotta be careful we could easily lose that so this is gonna be a northernmost one <clears throat> let's do some uh centride warriors shall we or centaur let's do uh centride warriors yeah that should work out pretty good it looks like we don't have any movement for this guy as that dryad queen over there takes one of our things that we captured so it's a bit of a dryad versus dryad conflict here I don't know why they're just sitting here I dislike that strongly though I do know that we have a lot of harpies here and the spawns here should be rather good in fact we could even upgrade it and make it better if we wanted to he has no movement points or anything else 16 First, these guys at this watchtower. We could probably take this town. I don't know if we want to just yet. It's definitely a possibility. Being down in the savannah probably isn't the best place for this army. Considering what they are. Wish we had some more magic items to give these guys. We have... A... Haraphidide. Who has enchanted sleep. And this is only a regular grove, isn't it? Wow. Yeah, we lost our only grove of Gaia, didn't we? To the other dryad. <clears throat> this could be called the Dryad Wars, I suppose. This moment in Elysium's history. As there's only uh, one other faction, I don't know what they are right now, but... Alive besides us in the other dryad. Perhaps it'll be poetic and the dryads will destroy each other. Regard oh, shit. Oh, well, it's a bunch of goblins. I'm not too worried about that. Mostly just goblins. Wow, that's actually a really weird army. Probably easily take that out. Considering they're not even goblin archers or anything. I don't believe they have the ability to recruit them. No, this would be... Oh, they have a few Bakamono bowmen towards the back. But for the most part, it's just regular old goblins that'll be destroyed when these guys rampage through their lines. Only issue might be the if they have some sort of charm spell and they cast it in our minotaurs, and we lose control over them. That'd be a shame. 52 units coming this way. Not looking forward to that. Do we want to make this safe and turn it into a bramble fort? It's a possibility. Could certainly be useful. Let's do that. Let's make it a little more safe, a little more protected. We have some Hoburg. Hoburo slingers. Hmm. What to do? Looks like we're just going to focus down in the army to the south. 
If they do attack us, I believe we'll win it rather easily. In fact, we might just want to attack them, especially after they fight that. Maybe not in the city. Or the town they just conquered. Because that could go bad rather quickly, but... Perhaps soon. Yeah, look how many, how many men they lost just fighting that. And that was a simple fight. Let's stick rather close. We have three movement per, points per turn with this one. So it's not too bad. You have men under you. Let's suggest you drop them off for now. Drop all these guys. Yeah, there you go. We're going to do some scouting with our centaur. That has the same movement points as everyone else. But we don't have any satyrs. Okay, I'll we'll just continue. We're just going to do this. Take a little piece of territory. Get a little more herbs. Ooh. Do you not have any casters? I, if I had more vision, I would love to go kill them. But unfortunately, we don't have that vision that we need. What is that? Did they just split up? Or was that a different army that came in there? Not 100%. Could get another Herafatide. These guys have some casters. Mm. And they did kill that vampire down to the south. Unfortunately. So this is just a bunch of goblins. Could easily win this fight. Let's kill them, and we'll kill this Dryad as well. Should be some good XP for our men. Them get a little more experience than they already are, which is they're quite experienced already. But they'll tear through this army rather easily. We have some javelins and stuff in the back that'll maul them as the minotaurs and regular old centaur cataphracts just charge their lines, wrecking through them. Yeah, nothing much to do to the north, which is a shame, but it's going to be like that for a little bit here as we recover from our past losses. Still only nine units towards the Forest of the Night. We're going to actually do this. Try and actually build up troops here. Oh, we could almost cast Bramble for it. But what effect would that really have, to be honest? Not much of one is the answer to that. We will recruit some regular Javelinist. We'll wait off and do the Bramble for it there next turn. Look at that. Beautiful. He does, she does have confusion, so that could make a dangerous situation. But they're all gonna go, yeah. Because he's confused. Still should be fine, though. As we tear through their line, easily destroying those forces. Well, they attacked. We don't have that wall up yet. And there's more than nine of them, but we do have this tree, which I don't know if they could see or not. Perhaps not, and we'll win because of the tree, and not because of him, probably, but we'll see. As blunt and pierce resistance, I don't think they have any slashing weapons. Of course, it's going to get attacked very fast here. And our Herafatide will die as well, probably. Which is unfortunate. Yeah, we're gonna lose it. Damn, it sucks we just wasted resources on that. Oh well. Just turn one of them to our side. Many of them are gonna die. But, uh, still gonna lose this. Because they're all poisoned. Poison here, poison there, poison everywhere. Yep, so we killed some of them, but regardless, if we had gotten that brand before it, we would have won that for sure. It would have been nice. But no such thing happened. We just lost a lot of resources there. Hmm. Could have just recruited that Raphatide there. Gotten more centaur spawning. 
Oh well. Oh well. Let's look at down south where we can take this town quite easily from the single goblin that holds it and get some more resources. So that we can build up our armies as we crush through their troops. One step at a time with our very strong army down south that could use more spellcasters. Hmm. A harpy scout. I think we're going to wait out for Call of Gaia. Or the Grove. The Call might be a better decision right now. We'll see. Some regular old dudes over here. We'll murders them. Should be easy enough. Yep. Easy enough indeed. As we just can demolish anything with this army. If Cloud of Confusion commands Beast and Sleep. That's not a bad set of spells. Got a frat commander and keeper of traditions. Don't really need one right now. I don't think it'll boost that anymore. Will it? The only the best unit with this ability would be able to use for single location. Hmm. They do have a dark mage as well here. But it's just a bunch of goblins. Oh shit. God damn it. Well, hopefully nothing attacks us while we are a bit vulnerable. Accidentally moving outside of our base. Hmm. Could go attack this. They only have goblins. You're quite the superior force. We have conf Let's do it. Unless they have some crazy dark magic spell, lashes of darkness. Just as weakness. Not a big deal as long as they don't have... Oh, I'm glad he doesn't have... Oh wait, no, tendrils doesn't do anything like that. Maybe that's a more advanced version of Tendrils that causes other issues. Either way, the fear is not going to cause much issues either. We'll be fine as we bust through this army. They've summoned Wolves and Curse of the Frog Prince. It's no big deal. Easily defeated. They're all weakened. But they're not decayed or anything, so I'm not worried about it. And we'll get a Ring of the Dead as well. Oh no, you frogged one of our men! I really hope he doesn't get killed, actually. He's a very expensive troop to just die as a frog. These minotaurs were hard to get. Cost us a lot. But we're gonna kill that caster pretty soon, anyway. Turn back! From your frog state. Do they turn back from the frog state? I hope they do. Be a shame if we just got a minotaur permanently turned into a frog. Maybe when he dies, he'll turn back? He's still a frog. Guess we'll know- oh, shit. Guess we'll know if we have a frog next time. If we, uh, have a permanent frog troop instead of our old guy here. One of the forests by our, uh, sacred grove is burning. That's not good. Let's move back. <gasps> oh, dear. This is bad. This is very, very bad. I hope this stops. Oh, what if this gets turned into a shadow wood? Oh, that'd be shitty. Should we just move everyone? Sacred Grove right here, it would be the same. Mass migration, people. Except we don't have the Hamadryad, but... At this point, I'm not too worried about that. Make sure everyone's selected. It's time to migrate, people. I think we have everyone that can move. Oh, shit. <clears throat> this could be bad. But I wasn't comfortable staying there anymore. Oh, God. They have three pans. Ugh. 
So are you you're permanently a frog, aren't you? Oh, wow, that's actually pretty damning. And we killed the caster for it, so it's ultimately probably worth it, but still sucks. We need to retake a uh, that grove of Gaia. Okay, they left us alone. And they're already taking this town. No. Nope. Gem of true seeing. Hmm. Where to run to is the big question here. Let's run this way, I suppose. With a Guinea. Guinea. Silver mine. Let's go to the sand. It's going to take a while to get off of, but still. It's nice to get a little gold income here and there. Upgrade to some centaur warriors. Leave us alone. Oh, they took our... They're taking everything. Took our port, finally. Dare we fight them. We have an astrologist. We have a massive amount of troops, comparatively. Hmm. <laughs> Can't cast Call of Gaia yet. Warriors. Let's go kill them. Six units left here. Not anything we really need. Yeah, because I believe that's all they have there, right? Unless there's more hidden ones that are going to show up later. We'll see. Hmm. Grove is right there, so we're just going to work our way north. Plow through these guys with their Grove Guards. Is the hope. And our Minotaurs that don't have any armor or anything, but still are pretty brutal animals. Slash men, Minotaur men. Man animals. Manimals. It's a good wor word for them. Manimals. I can dig it. As we try and get through their lines. We do only have fisting troops too. But I believe it will win. Maybe we'll summon some murder crows. Yep. To come up behind and distract their casters or whatever. Who has mind burn, words of the void, confusion. Come on. Attack, my friends, attack. Oh, why is it frozen? It's no good. There we go. Watch as their grove guard. Hopefully kill this Herafetide. Herafet... Or, sorry, Centaur Sage. We're gonna lose our grove guard. Oh, we'll skip past the rest of this. We got a gem of true seeing. Someone else has moved closer to us. One hundred and eighty-two. Oh god. We only have ninety-nine units now, but that's okay. Oof. We're in a bad spot again. Is it really easy to lose this game to a faction that is steamrolled? Really easy indeed. Let's hope this grove of Gaia isn't too well protected and we can find a new home there. And build up. And hopefully that's not too powerful of a person who just landed next to our advanced army. <laughs> we have ten herbs. Who are you? What the fuck is that? A Neiman lion. Has a bite. The Neiman Niemian Nemian? I don't I don't know. Lion is a lion of tremendous size and beautiful golden skin. Just like the Theronic lion. This huge lion also has 
unpierceable skin, and it could withstand any number of arrows without feeling more than a itch. Disciplining a Nemean lion would be very difficult as it is unlikely to feel anything short of a maul to the leg, but luckily this is seldom required as the Nemean lion is smarter than its smaller brethren. Wow. It's pierce and slash resistance and fire resistance. It's fast, giant size, 102 HP. Mm -hmm. That would cause some issues for us. I don't know if we have a command B spell. Be hard to even get that to be commanded. Because it has decent magic resistance. And great armor. It has very thick skin. This is an anointed of Gaia as well, so it has level 3 force magic. Hopefully they don't attack us. Oh, there's also a troll pit. How wonderful. Yep, it's just gonna ignore us as we try and take that grove, and they're gonna attack our old grove there as well. Hopefully this does some work. Could curse Woodham, shoot its poison. See that, that's beautiful. Turn them all into trees. Unfortunately, I do believe we're going to lose this base no matter what, but at least it will be funny as we turn them all to trees and we watch as our base level satyrs try and hold them off. It's actually working quite well. These satyrs are protecting the tree from harpies, and the rest of these guys are all being cursed into pieces of wood and poisoned. May I actually kill them, <laughs> or the majority of them. Here come some of them. At least their commander. Curse wood. Of course. And the commander's resisting it. He may cause some issues. As there's only two units left here. And there's not a lot of harpies left. We killed most of the harpies already. Harpies are easy to kill though. What else do you have? You have strength. Ooh, probably should have had poison arrow. Brutally murdering these guys, though. This uh, Hamadryad is quite powerful. If only he could murder this dude right here, right now. Who's causing him actual damage and harm. There we go, he's got poison on him. Beautiful. Come on, one more. One more. So close, there we go. And this guy has moved up. Maybe they'll actually win. Uh oh. He's very close to death, but who knows? I uh, missed the tree spell on them. He's gonna die. Oh, nope. He's got one HP. And everyone else is trees. He just completely he's just murdering them. Since they come up so slowly because they're all being turned into trees. Well, what the heck? We kept our sacred grove for another turn. These Hamadryads are nothing to laugh, laugh about. Quite good. <gasps> what? Okay, we lost it, but they got one satyr there. I don't know why our tree just died. I guess it equated who had the least hit points. That's kind of silly. And we're getting ambushed here. Who knows by what? Hopefully nothing too bad. I forgot about this guy. Let's take this temple, and then we can move down here and start spawning centaurs. Oh, just a couple satyrs. No big deal. Easily killed by this army. Beautiful. We confuse our own troops. Everything's fine, though. As we take back our Grove of Gaia that we're going to need to defend better. Could just... Uh... So we got another Grove of Gaia again. North. Ooh. Sacred Grove. Do you have Command Beast? You have Befriend Animal. There's a goat. Somehow I worry about how this would go. I don't know why, but I just do. Whether that's rational or not, I don't know. I'd use a bramble for it there. But I'd really like to call 
upon Gaia's might to, to get us something good. Did he move the bears? Oh, ambushed, of course. Hopefully been nothing too nasty. I think he did move some troops here. Bunch of white centaurs. Ugh. That's no good. Do we need a bramble for it? It'd be nice. Let's do it. Keep this place more secure. And we'll just plan a hummer dryad. We need to make it safe. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's a shadow tree. They must have enchanted it. Should be easy to chop down with our axes, though. Because we actually do have some axes. Which are good against trees. Tree type units. Man, they're just gonna start massing to kill us. Hoplite commanders available. And I don't know. Create we have call of God. This was some weird spells to start with. Do a bramble fort. To hold it. Not else. Not a lot we can do, really. Do that. What beautiful music. More javelinist, since we have a really good front line. Just need troops that can fire down upon people who decide to face us. Of course, the Grove will have a nice spawn, right? If only we had a Minotaur of Traditions over here. Whatever, we'd spawn a bunch of Minotaurs. Hmm. Sit everyone here. Well, actually, we'll keep him under his command. It's just a regular, yeah, it's just a regular sacred grove. You will go be our scout and scout out the lands to the, to the east. The eastern lands, who knows what they will hold. Let's take that town. Try and get some gold going here as well. Oh, a haunted city. I'll take that for right now. <laughs> it's a lonely cataphract commander. Oh, how lonely he is indeed. His people have been slaughtered by the opposite dryad. Perhaps we'll find the other faction too. I don't recall if we've been told already. It's been a while since I played. Let's give the game a save or just dryad recording. We'll walk through the woods with our cataphract commander. He does have 2 XP. That's pretty cool. Hmm. It'd almost be smarter to do a Call of Gaia on this guy, rather. Because he has the option. Or she does. So is that really all that's there? Gaining things at a nice speed. That of which we can gain. Let's murder those guys. Move forward with Bupasperon. And we're gonna murder, murder Minotaur Lord here. Wish we could enchant it. Maybe we'll confuse it. Nope, it'll just die to our bronze bulls. Our mighty army of them. Oh shit, what is this? Oh god. As they encroach upon our cataphract commander, hoping to get a piece of him. 54, only 54, huh? This guy is rather powerful, though. He's real good at living and casting spells. Is that a donkey? Giant rats. Huh. 
We could really use a pan, just like this guy. Hopefully our casting of the Call of Gaia will summon a pan. It's a lot of goblins. Yeah, they could probably kill us right here. Our cataphract. Yep. Oh well. He was trying to scout. Didn't scout much, but he did his best, I believe so. As he'll die being charged at by our enemies. Or, in particular, our one enemy that is rather strong. Hello, Ra. Take that mine. What is your centaur spawn? Or your satyr? Probably less than the dryad, I believe. Yep. Dryad has a wow at four. That's a nice boost. Uh oh. Yeah. I think we'd be okay. Need to do a call of Gaia. Are you fortified over here? Yes, you are. So we all we are all fortified. At least there's that. We are all safely fortified behind our walls. Oh, they're gathering a force, it seems, perhaps. I think we're going to want to stay safe. I don't know what we're going to do here. We've been cornered. This may be a loss, but it was a valiant effort, if so. This game is rather difficult to win at times. It can be rather challenging. Okay, yeah, they're building... A force up here to perhaps assault us. Hmm. Might as well do that. But otherwise, we're going to want to keep them with their bows. Hmm. Yep. They do all have long bows. I thought I saw minus one. They're all plus ones, though. Of course. Oh, we'll do the Call of Gaia next turn. See how it goes. Oh, there's a pan over here now. I forgot how we lost our early pan. It was anticlimactic. Perhaps we would want to wait and get... Well, nah, it wouldn't be worth it. It's called Gaia. Oh, uh, and all she gave us was a cup of white. What? Oh, that's a crap, crap use of that. Ugh. Just some white centaurs. Anyway, guys, that's gonna be the episode. Thank you for watching. I appreciate all your support. And I'll see you next time.